all you cool kids and families. It's Dawn and Lucy here, and we're just a couple of geologists. Now, how do geologists relax after a day of stone sorting? Why, in our rocking chair, of course. Now, geologists study rocks, and today we will talk about the physical properties of those rocks. Lucy and I, we dug up some great examples for you. Enjoy. The first example we have here is sorting rocks by their size. Now we could have sorted them by their shape, like thin, thick, skinny, fat, short, or long. We chose to sort these rocks according to size. From left to right, we have big, medium, and small rocks. Lucy has chosen to stop and investigate the medium rocks. These rocks are sorted by their physical property, color. There are rocks that don't seem to have a color, a term called translucent. We have also sorted black, pink, red, tan, and white rocks. Lucy, do me a solid and touch this rock. Doesn't it feel rough and bumpy? We are talking about texture. Now touch this rock. Doesn't it feel smooth? Texture is the feel of a surface, and this is smooth. I know Lucy is almost sleeping like a rock, but we have one more physical property to examine. These rocks are sorted by their pattern. The rocks on the left have solid, the rocks in the middle have spots, and the rocks on the right are stripes. Well, that's it. Those are the stone cold facts. Those are just some of the ways to classify or sort rocks based on their physical properties. Remember kids, never take learning for granted. Bye everyone.